What's going on, everybody? It is Beefy Chief. Good to see everybody in here today. Um, I'm actually going to be dipping into an early access version of a game called Johnny Graves The Unchosen One. This is a uh, brand new game that's actually supposed to come out. Uh, what is it? The 15th. Maybe I got that right or wrong. It's, it's going to be probably a little later. Uh, probably like. I should probably come out on the Pacific side first. <laughs> Was it like. I think I got, they told me 11 p.m. Uh, California time. I guess California has their own time zone, but hey, good for you guys. <laughs> so, um, I actually was able to get a copy of this game. Really excited about it. Came across on it on Steam. Um, it, I actually don't know how much the game will be. Uh, it's bummer, really. Oh, <laughs> don't do not know how much the game will be just yet. Um, obviously this is early access version. It's kind of a little bit of mix between action, indie game, and RPG. Also with a little bit of uh, kind of like a survival type of mode to it. So it's definitely uh, kind of dips into a lot of different areas. And uh, I don't know, one of the things that really kind of peaked out to me, uh, really just made itself known was honestly the, the artwork of this game. It's kind of, it's interesting. It's got an interesting storyline too with it. Uh, basically, you're a character who is kind of uh, was he's uh, basically meeting up with one of his friends in a cemetery. He basically has to work his way through the cemetery to meet up with one of his friends, and kind of his whole story story unfolds. So it's really interesting um, as you kind of go along. As you see, let's so let's kind of dip into this. I see you made it to the cathedral. Ooh, wait, can you see what I see? How exactly does this psych psychic connection thing work? Does it really matter? It does if I need a bathroom break. Focus, please. Best friend in mortal danger. Point the way. You have to find a way inside the cathedral. Patty should still be in there. So he's basically looking for his friend. Friend's friend. And... Also, the cult that set up shop here not too long ago. See? People drink way too much... Too much uh, Kool-Aid. This is what I get. So basically, as you can see, he holds a giant freaking revolver, and he's basically running around, running about. And as you can see there, you also have a special shot that you can use as well, where actually, actually comes in, <laughs> actually comes in handy to be honest with you. And there we go. Little almost glitched here for a second. Beep beep, boop boop, pop pop. Bop, bop, bop. Bad. Bad zombie. So yeah, you kind of have like these zombie looking things or this cult. <laughs> cult zombies, same thing. Um, basically chasing after you. So it's uh, it's it's interesting. I think the storyline is what really got me. Uh, really kind of piqued my interest from there. So it's really kind of kept me engaged with it. I've actually played... Okay, get you, get you. I actually played probably a good hour or so on this game, maybe a little bit longer. Try to get a feel for it because, uh, believe it or not, this as you kind of progress, the game actually gets pretty tough. The hardest thing, honestly, it's all these damn zombies. They start chasing after you. They start running like 75 miles an hour at your face. You start to panic, start shooting left and right. Um. So just when you think you're in the clear, I mean, <laughs> these things start to group up on you. And it's kind of hard to kind of be able to sit back and try to like, try to be able to, to aim at the same time, try to kill these things. So. Oh, 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 sorry. 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 Um, if you guys have not uh, looked into it too, the developers of this game, ironically, they're called uh, Stupid Stupid Games. Really, uh, honestly, I got to talk to them a little bit. Really good people. Uh, really nice. Uh, so definitely, if you guys ever get a chance, you know, tweet them out or something. Um, really awesome game that they kind of that they were able to put together, despite I'm sure the budget wasn't millions of dollars, but for the resources, they actually did a pretty nice job. You actually have a really good base uh, with the graphics. I think the graphics were pretty interesting. They actually did a really nice job with it, as you guys can see as we kind of go about here. Really awesome stuff. Um, 
the nice grass kind of flowing through. The death's keeping it alive. <laughs> it's nice and beautiful in a cemetery. You will never hear that ever again. Bam. Bam, son. No, no. Bad. 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 There you go. Stay down. Word of, word of the wise for you guys. Make sure you really utilize this uh, special shot because it has saved me more times than you could ever count. Oh, jeez. Get up here. Get up here. The nice thing about this, though, he can jump like a Kenyan. Or was it? Wait, what? Speed like a Kenyan. Either way, you, you get my you get my drift. <laughs> no, it's it's actually interesting stuff. I I think. I mean, for for the character of motion, though. I mean, as you can see, look, just looking at him, it's actually pretty fluid stuff. Really, uh, for a smaller indie game, it actually does a really nice job with it. Definitely. Interesting to say the least. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Bad. Just sit here quietly. Now this is kind of where the things start to get a little bit sketchy. As we kind of go down here, you'll see it. Right there. You have these bloodthirsty spiders. Which honestly, they just kind of come out of nowhere. I When I first played this, I was running about over here. Oh jeez. And it's like this stuff. It's exactly like this. this. Now, this is kind of probably like one of my only gripes about the game is with the camera because you can't really see the spiders up in the trees whatsoever. Uh, they basically throw these little flame balls. And then this happens where you basically fall into some fire. It's a bad situation. Bad, 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 bad. Bad. Bad, bad. See, honestly, it's kind of. I honestly have to probably ask yourself, you know, should I take these shots from these spiders? So it's, it's, it's a rough situation, I think. When I first played this game, you're, oh jeez, you honestly were kind of in a bad. Honestly, I was in such a bad spot that I had no choice. Oh jeez, man, what are you doing? Don't hurt yourself. So. The nice thing though about the health system now, I was kind of griping that uh, there wasn't a whole lot of uh, uh, health kits at all throughout the game, but luckily, uh, as you kind of go on, um, you, you actually got to see a few of them as we kind of go along to different corners. Jeez. Uh, but also, the nice thing about it as well has to be the fact that uh, that after every little bit of con combat you see like these little bars down here they actually fill up for you bad jeez bad down there you go bad and you gotta watch out for these glowing Zombies, they are god awful. They actually, some, they're like, they explode or something like that. They give off like this weird chemical reaction. And if you're in the vicinity of it, you will die. You will die. And it's kind of, it's just super duper annoying. That's why I kind of just stand back. You really, honestly, you have to take your time with this game. You to, honestly, you really have to sit back, take your time with it. Because it's pretty tough. Alright, we're I know there's a spotted up here. Bad. Now this area I've been up for up to before and it's been rough. Bad. <laughs> Long range shots. Just give me a sniper rifle, I'll be okay. Go. Oh. Bad. Man, what's what's wrong with you? Leave me alone. I just want to take a nice little stroll in my cemetery. Y'all are just ruining it. Bad. God, move, 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 move. Panic. Bad. There we go. 
That's exactly what I was talking about with this stuff. It's... <laughs> you can really put yourself in a bad situation. Ah! Ah! Ah, oh, that did not mean to do that. Uh, also, too, the thing with the ammo as well, with the revolver, you... So far from my understanding of it, it's basically unlimited. Oh. Jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. There we go. <laughs> Run and panic, then you just use your special move, they're done. They're dead. Alright, let's see if we can make our way up to Cathedral. Since, you know, my friend had no idea where the hell it was. Oh, please don't. No, bad idea, bad idea, son of a... Biz niche. Poop. As you can see, that's kind of like the gist of it a little bit. It's, it's really an interesting game. Here so far. Um... I mean, that's, that's one thing that really cut the, really attracted my, uh, my eye to it. Dip, interesting storyline. And it also had a little bit of, um, really just had a, like a lot of different creativity. Like I said, I, I usually always look for, I always tend to look for solid indie games that people don't really, uh, uh, I guess expect or people really have an eye on. So whenever I get a chance to, you know, play one, I always t get the chance to at least, I mean, it, Honestly, I'm sure you guys have been on Steam before. Always go on there on, on Steam Greenlight or some of the upcoming games. Definitely always check them out because there's some awesome, awesome indie games. Stuff that I think people tend to overlook a little bit. Jeez. It's literally like I Am Legend. You make a little noise and everyone starts panicking. Start running at you. It's gonna come. And boom. Ah, uh, it's the worst part. Bad. Oh, I see you, son. I see you, baby. Shake that ass. There we go. Look at that jump. I honestly have not used jumping a whole lot. Otherwise, I mean, other than me, you know, basically getting stuck in a getting stuck in a grave would be the only time I've ever really used it. Be yeah, actually be kind of surprised how many times it actually happens. Oh god no, please don't, please don't, please don't, please don't, please don't. It's like suicide bombers, it's they're so annoying. Oh no, bad. I'm supposed to get them all. Got to catch them all. There we go. We're good. Solid. We Gucci. Yeah, as you can kind of see, it's a lot of basic stuff with it, um, as you kind of go about the... Oh, jeez, no. Bad idea. I got a... Remember, I got an eye on this guy. The last time I did. No. Fine. Right here. Damn it. Damn it. Bad, bad, all oh, crap, they're coming. They're coming, all right. Bad. Down. Son, don't make me do it. Jeez. See, I'm not, I'm like, I'm trying to, like, to not get close to these things. Like, at all. They are... So annoying. On so many levels. See, that's how you do it. Get rid of that sucker. Every time. Bad. Bad. See, it's tough to time it up, especially when you have all these zombies at you. But that's why... Oh, crap. Oh, bad. Oh, bad. Oh, bad. So, super bad. Super duper bad. There we go. Wow, I'm actually surprised I even got out of that. <laughs> Alright, get him. Don't worry about me, I got this. Alright. Oh no, don't chase me. Please don't chase me. Bad. Don't do it. I hate those things so bad, so much. Uh, I was doing so well. It's also too, I think with uh, this game a little bit 
whenever you play it when you think you're shooting somebody but they're kind of like in your face and they still uh, add damage to you it's kind of you know that happens it's annoying but it happens bad bad so now I know what's a now I know what's a beyond that area where we were last time bad Bad. There we go. Got him. Let's get. Oh, jeez. Bad. Bad idea. Can you, like, not do that? Thank you. Oh, I already grabbed them all? Son of a poop. That's crap. That's utter crap. No. I believe it's, it's like, two shots. Uh, per, per, uh, person here, or per, like, zombie, whatever it is. There we go. It's gonna reload real quick. Boop, 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 boop. No. Jeez, y'all just falling from the sky, aren't you? Ah. See, it's stuff like that. Like, when they're in their face and, like, when you're in your, oh, gosh. They're in your face and then, like, you shoot them, then they don't die, even though they're right there. It's kind of a... A weird glitch. No. There we go. Bad. Bad. No. But as you guys can get a feel for it already, um, it's it's definitely an interesting game. So, uh, once again, uh, it's Johnny Graves and the Unchosen One. It's uh, right now, obviously, it's early access version. It will be out, I believe, later on. Was it the uh, June fifteenth, uh, June two June fifteenth, two thousand sixteen? Can't talk today, so bad. Um, it actually be out I think later on that day, but uh, kind of keep an eye out for it, guys. Really, really, really fun stuff. If you guys have any questions about it, feel free to leave them in the comments. Uh, if you also want to see a series on this, uh, feel free to let me know as well. I can definitely do that for you guys. Uh, put uh, actually leave a comment. In the, in the comments, uh, letting me know if you guys want to see a series, or even then, give give uh, give this video a thumbs up. See what happens. Thanks, guys, and uh, see y'all soon.